Hello guys, welcome back to a new video. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use TensorArt to create a prompt image. So just please follow my steps until the end, and let's begin the tutorial. So from here, I can go and open my browser, and then I'll go to Google directly. And from Google, I'm going to search for TensorArt. And I'll open this website here, which is TensorArt, free online image generator and model hosting, and click on it. Just make sure that you need to log in or create a new account by clicking on this option. In my case, I have account already, but if not, you're going to see login over here on this place where I put my mouse on. So once created an account or login, you can go here and create and click on it. In here we have text to image, image to image or animate. You can choose whatever you want. So in my case, I can tell, I'll go to text to image and I can write here, I would like to see a cat wearing a hat or let's make it a red hat and a t-shirt. And here you can have multiple options, negative prompt and so on. You can use all of these extra options, but I'm not going to use them. I'm just going to go directly to click on generate. By the way, you can choose how many copies you would like to. I'm going to make it one and choose generate over here and wait a few seconds until creating the model. And now once generated done, you can see here a cat with a red hat. And this is exactly what we wrote here, but we just missed more information, which is t-shirt. So we can write more information and get more prompt. And you can click on generate to get better results and so on. By the way, this expired in 15 days. So just make sure to use it before 15 days. Because once 15 days are gone, this picture is going to be expired. At the end, that was all today's video. If you find this very helpful, please don't forget to like the video. Subscribe to the channel. And thanks for watching.